Also, check it out guys, we're back with a brand new episode on the channel. My name is General Tony and welcome my friends to my Town Hall 12 base. Now, if you've been subscribed to the channel for at least a week, which you should be if you haven't subscribed, make sure you join the family guys on our way to two and a half million subscribers. But check this out, I promised you guys a week ago, we were going to be upgrading the clan castle from level 7 to level 8. It is a 12 million gold upgrade, so it's the biggest upgrade you can do at Town Hall 12. But the beautiful thing about this is, for the first time in the history of COC, we will be unlocking a 40 housing space troop capacity in the CC, guys. That means we can bring two dragons inside of a single clan castle, four baby dragons, one baby dragon, one electro dragon. Loads of different troop combos, guys. We are increasing the troop capacity from 35 to 40. So, what we're going to do, we need 12 million gold. We've got 11,370,000. So, we need to get ourselves into just one single live attack. We need to wreck the base, steal all this gold. Then, we're going to come back. We're going to click the upgrade button, guys. 12 million gold. And then we're going to go into our magic items and we're going to use the book of building to send the clan castle straight to level 8 from level 7. So by the end of this episode you are watching right now, we will be a YouTuber, a down or 12 with a level 8 CC guys. And then when we get ourselves into our next clan wars and even do live attacks, we can use 40 troops. It is going to be pretty damn epic. So let's do this guys. If you think... We are going to be able to upgrade it by the end of the video. Smash that like button. Let's go for a like goal. Let's go for 3,000 likes on the episode, guys. So let's do this. Here we go. All we need is one live attack. Get all the gold. Come back, upgrade it. Use the magic item. And finally, my friends, we will have unlocked a level 8 clan castle. By the way, if you made it this far into the episode, let me know down below in that comment section, guys, what level... Is your clan castle and what town hall level are you? Let's see if anyone's got any maxed out CCs. But for now, my friends, stay tuned. We'll be back in a couple of moments. Okay, so here we go, guys. We've landed on the perfect opponent. This dude is rocking just under 500,000 gold. Plus, we're going to get ourselves a loot bonus. So that's going to take us to the 12 million that we need. So we do need to triple star him. And what we are going to do, let's take a little scout. He doesn't have an eagle artillery, so that's awesome. I'm going to come in with a queen over here. And we're going to use a baby dragon just up the top to take out those buildings, guys. To go down the left-hand side and take out this air defense, guys. So let's see if she is going to do what we want. Here we go. Baby dragon moving in on that mortar, taking it down almost. Almost, not quite. Let's see if the queen's going to take out the air defense. Yes, she is. And we are off to an amazing start, guys. So what we're going to do, we are going to use a Rage Spell. And I'm going to get some Wall Breakers moving into this base. Because we want to get the Queen a little bit deeper. So let's send in the rest of those Wall Breakers. And we're into the next layer. All we need to do is avoid that single target Inferno Tower. So we're going to send the Baby Dragon in there. Giants are going to follow up. Here we go, guys. We're going to drop in the Wall Wrecker. Ball is just behind, and there goes the rest of the army. So, we've got our jump spell. Let's drop it into the cool. Let's go with a rage spell, guys. And we're going to use the poison and the free spell on the single target Inferno Tower, guys. There goes the king's ability, rocking our way into the center. And we're going to use the Grand Warden's ability as well, guys. So, free spell is going to go down on the second Inferno Tower. There goes the final rage spell. And it looks like the core of this dude's base is about to get splattered. Let's see if we can take him out for a three-star, guys. Here we go. We got so many troops alive. And we've even got all the healers in the center as well, making sure they don't die, guys. What are we up to? 74%. Let's use a minion. Let's take out that army camp there. What have we got? We still got the queen's ability, guys. Still got giants, witches, bowlers. So many troops left alive. I'm calling it now. It looks like it is a beautiful three star. So when we go back, we're going to use the magic item and our gold. And we will be upgrading. So let's pop the queen's ability. Let's actually three star this guy. Let's three star him. So we've got these buildings up the top. They look like they're about to go down. The queen is cleaning the rest down the bottom. And it is a 97, 98, 99. And there is the final structure, guys. Triple star in the back. 
beautiful start to the episode. And there it is, 100% loot bonus. That gives us the 12 million gold we required. And we can do the upgrade finally, guys. So, let's do this. Here we go. Okay, so 12 million gold. Let's head over to the clan castle and let's click that upgrade button, guys. Clan castle to level 8. There it is, my friends. And let's see what the difference is. So that's what it looks like at level 7. Let's just set this as active. And let's bring up that clan castle, guys. Where is it? Let's move the laboratory down here. Don't forget, we're also upgrading the Eagle Artillery. That's what it looks like at level 7. We got all those dragons, by the way, already, guys. Click the Finish Now button. And whoa! Okay. That actually looks really cool. I didn't know it was going to look that cool, guys. Let's just move these buildings over. And let's see if we can get a cool little screenshot of that, because I'm impressed. Good job to... Sh uh, shout out to Supercell, guys. They they they've made this clan castle look a lot better than I thought it would. Let's just bring it here. And um, let's get a little screenshot of that. That looks awesome. It's got like a blue, blue roof to it. I don't know why there is um, sleep little signs coming out of it, but it definitely looks cool. So what we're going to do now, we are going to request ourselves two dragons. Let's go for two dragons. Thank you. Now, we might not get them instantly, guys. I'm not sure if there's that many people online, but um, hopefully we can. And then we'll get ourselves into a live attack, trying out the new level, what is it, level 8? Level 8 CC using those dragons. So, stay tuned, guys. We'll be back in a couple of moments. We're going to see if we can get ourselves some troops, and then we'll try it out in a live attack. Yo, so check it out, guys. We're back, and we have got ourselves two dragons inside of my clan castle. So, this is going to be pretty damn epic. We got the three heroes, five rage spells, two free spells, a poison... And we've got 15 level 7 dragons, 13 inside of our camps, guys. And as I said, we've got two of them inside of that new level clan castle. So what I want to do, I am going to try and take out these two air defenses here. Just before we do, I'm going to use one dragon, guys. Just one dragon to take out these buildings and hopefully make a funnel for my queen and my king. So now the king is free to do some damage. We're going to drop him in. And I really need this queen to make her way into those air defenses, guys. Now, we don't have any wall breakers, so it's definitely going to be tricky. But let's just see if we can do it anyway. So, here we go. Queen is going to drop that archer tower. She's going to drop the cannon as well. And I'm hoping she's going to take out the mortar and then go for the wall. Here we go. Is she going to go in, guys? The cannon's going to get dropped and she's going to go around. Okay, that's not really the best thing, but... She's maybe going to be able to take out the Eagle Artillery. Let's find out. There goes the Queen's ability. Is she going to go for the Eagle? No, she's not. She's going to go for the Tesla Tower. Does a little bit of damage to the Eagle, guys. But at least we still kind of made a funnel. Okay, so let's go for Phase 2. We're going to use another Dragon over here. The Eagle Artillery still hasn't even opened its eyes, guys. And we've still got 13 Dragons, not including the one on the battlefield. So we're looking good. Let's see if this dragon's going to be able to take out this gold and the elixir storage. Then we can drop the rest of the troops in this area and make our way down towards the town hall, guys. Now, I'm not expecting a three-star, of course. This is only using dragons, so it's harder to get a triple star. So, now we've done it. Let's move in with the rest of these dragons, guys. Check it out. We're going to use the clan castle, and two dragons are going to come out of it. So, let's use a free spell. On that air defense, let's drop in these dragons. And let's use another free spell on the Inferno Tower. Here we go. Poison spell's going to go down. We're going to drop another Rage spell. And we're going to use the Grand Warden's ability, saving most of my poor little dragons, guys. So we still got more Rage spells. And it looks like we're moving into this base with loads of dragons left alive. This is brutal destruction. And this dude's going to... He's, he's going to be in a bit of trouble, guys. Here we go. Let's use another Rage, moving in for the second Inferno Tower, already taking it down, and I'm not going to lie, we've done a lot better than I predicted. I didn't think we were going to have this many dragons left alive, guys. It looks like there's seven or eight of them. One over on the left-hand side as well, and uh, the last air defense actually goes down. If I was to be honest, I would say if we had extra time, this would be an easy three-star, guys, and that's pretty insane considering all we've used is literally dragons and heroes. 
insane, absolutely beautiful, game over, 81% damage using that dragon attack strategy, guys. And of course, that now means I can use those dragons inside of the Nyx clan war, and it's going to give me five extra housing spaces, so I am definitely over the moon about that. Let's collect the loot from the treasury. We've got five million elixir. I think we're going to be saving our elixir. And we're going to do another upgrade, guys. Maybe the wall breakers. And we'll do some troll attacks using them. But for now, my friends, we will be ending this episode here. Thank you so much for the constant support here on the YouTube channel as we approach 2.4 million subscribers. There will be a second episode coming in a couple of hours' time, so make sure you stay tuned, guys. I'll see you shortly. Have a great day, great evening, wherever you are around the world. Peace out.